concrete and XL. Soft wet snow. Nothing better to do. Break stuff. Apparently this model doesn't have air brakes. Huh, weird. Could have swore I paid for that. Woo! Aha, balls. Bigger tires. Bigger, bigger tires. Apparently it's not broke. At least not broke enough to stop it from running. <laughs> yeah, it was a bad angle that I was at. Couldn't tell. No slap in there. <laughs> no slap in there. Well, maybe a little. <laughs> or a lot. to see how well it can cope with this snow. I think as long as it's moving, it'll go, but as soon as you stop, it's done. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I'm walking out there, that's for sure. <laughs> I knew that was coming. So bitch. I gotta ruin my nice clean surface. Ooh, oh, we got some deers. Deers. But waiting to see if my bro's gonna show up with his X Max and the Power Hobby paddles, but uh, so far now. But uh, that's why I've been trying to stay off of this snow as much as possible because once I tear it all up, well, it won't be that good for that. What do you think? If I throw it, will it just keep going? Maybe. Doubt it. Try it. <laughs> nope. No clearance, Clarence. Oh well. And no ice fishermen out there. Huh. Weird. I guess you can't ice fish on slush. Apparently. Pussies. <laughs> 
No, nope, haven't seen a soul out on the lake this year. It's been that bad. Too warm. El Nino. Whatever they call it. This looks a little squatty. I don't know why. This should clear it out. Some of it anyway. Yeah. Yeah. It's not so squatty now. Weird. That plant-based uh, red cat <laughs> plastic body is not holding up very well. Biodegradable. Oh. <laughs> not sure what pinion's on here. Probably a. I don't know, 13, 14 maybe. I got <clears throat> roughly a one year out of this red cat shredder body. Um, yeah, it's crappy. It's that weird crappy fucking plastic. Definitely not Lexan. I think it's biodegradable Lexan. But I'm wondering about the uh, machete body if it's made out of the same crappy plastic. I may end up just going back to a standard Creighton body through the extended uh, rear mounts or whatever standoffs. I don't know. We'll see. He's almost off now. Weird. Look <laughs> at that freaking thing. Holy crap. <sighs> well, uh, there's one pin still left, but maybe we can make it stay to some extent. Let's see. Let's see if we can get something out of it. I only leave it on because it looks so good. Otherwise, I'd take it off. But it just looks so damn good. <laughs> right. It actually wasn't bad looking at first. Oh, shit. Just knocked the other pin out. Fuck's sake. For fuck's sake. Let's try this one more time. I don't know why I bought it because it ain't like it's gonna stay. There it is. Not like it's gonna stay, but it might last one or two jumps. Let's see. 
so yeah, it's just a Mojave with Creighton suspension shocks. Still got the, I think they're Mojave gearboxes. They were both the XBs, so I don't think there's any difference. Shut down. Uh-oh. Must have come unplugged. Weird. Hmm. I did uh, move the battery tray to the, what was it, rearward position. And uh, my battery cable was a little bit short. And it did make it, but it was tight, so I put an extension on it, and uh, I think the extension's a little too much. It just kind of slaps around in there, unfortunately. But I'm sure it still works. Why wouldn't it work? Oh yeah, and by the way, <laughs> I uh, blew apart a Creighton front hub on one of my last uh, outings when I hit that wall over there and uh, all I had on hand was Mojave which are much shorter about 10 millimeters and uh, I did uh, have some Typhon slash Mojave stub axles so we have Creighton on one side and Mojave on the other side so I don't know if you can tell but this wheel is in about 10 millimeters give or take from the other side I was gonna do both but I said eh, I don't know if I'm gonna even leave it like that I'm really thinking about those AD, ADU racing aluminum ones I don't know kind of pricey I mean they're, they're probably the cheapest aluminum ones that are considered decent but I don't know if uh, I'm really sold on aluminum hubs I mean geez this thing's three years old well over two maybe not three but over two and that's my first actual broken hub so I don't know I don't really see much of a reason to spend all that money if I'm not breaking hubs. For those who do break I'm sure it makes sense but I'm not really having that many problems. I mean I bought I bought the spare Mojave hubs front and rear from Jenny's and I can't remember exactly why I did but I've had them forever and uh I was going to throw Mojave front hubs and stubs on this just to see if I like the handling any better because I thought it might turn better but for track type use not necessarily wide open blasting and jumping obviously wider is better for that but winter is the only time I really do this kind of stuff the rest of the time it's like track ish use racing slash demolition derby with Maximoto. <laughs> yeah. Throttle wasn't the right call on that one. But anyway, uh yeah, obviously we need a new body. Uh Front upper arms are sloppy as all heck. Rears are quite sloppy as well. Hubs. <laughs> Steering is, uh, well, might need some attention there. But anyway, not now, I'm busy. 
too busy right now. Too busy. Far too busy for that nonsense. Say the battery's getting a little soft. Seems. Usually it goes dead much quicker because I'm usually talking less and driving more. But anyway, it was a fun project to uh, come up with body mounts and everything, figure out what kind of body I could use that I thought was gonna look cool. It looked all right for a while, but obviously <laughs> it didn't last. Not soft, soft, but I think it is losing a little bit. So anyway, I'm gonna uh, finish this off and then we'll uh, See if we can break the X Max. X Mike. I did break the Kaiju the other day. I'm not sure what I did yet. Uh, lost the rear shock. Looks fine from the outside. So either I may have just lost the clip on the shock shaft for the piston or it broke the piston. I'm not sure which. I haven't taken it apart, but kind of bummed because that is one of my favorites for uh, this kind of stuff here. Of course this is doing quite well as well so can't say I'm disappointed here other than the body. There it is, LVC folks. All right, thanks for checking it out. Peace.